hey everyone welcome to code with sub channel in this video we will create a side menu from right to left for those languages like pashto arabic urdu persian and other languages which are which are from right to left so in react js okay we will create this side menu in react js using a package by the name of react pro sidebar so now let's get started guys before starting please subscribe our youtube channel Yeah, to create the sidebar so first of all we should install a package which is uh, npm we will use npm or yarn whatever npm install react pro sidebar okay install this package i have already installed this package after installing so let's now use it how to use it first of all i will import it i will import the sidebar from this okay sidebar and also the submenu menu submenu menu item and also sidebar header sidebar header content sidebar sidebar header footer sidebar header okay we have imported this component from react pro sidebar so now let's import the mm, uh, our uh, scss part file also import scss <coughs> let's get our function yeah create a deal here we will use our um, pro sidebar so in this pro sidebar sidebar we will use other component like menu menu item sub menu and header footer all of them so first of all i will use the um, header of the sidebar okay so let's use that sidebar header so inside the header you can import your image your logo your uh, name of your website whatever you would like i will just strike it so it is a right to, to left uh, sidebar so i will use here the names of arabic or pashto or urdu language side menu okay it is a pashto language and here i will use the content sidebar content in the sidebar content we will include our menu menu items okay so first of all i will import the menu in menu now we will use our menu item and sub menu okay first of all let's uh, import a menu item sorry yeah menu item here we will write the name so i will write the names later because it need to change the keyboard uh, after menu menu i will import one another and also after that to have a sub menu sub menu yeah in sub menu again we will have this menu so now i will write the names of things yeah first of all Korpana it means home in Pashto language Korpana means home and also Arika Arika means contact and also here I will write it means about us and here I will use the title and the title with us and also the icon which we will use here the title will be sub menu 
and the icon I will import the icon later and so let's import the icons first I will import for example like this one and also for art from react icons slash file okay I have imported these icons I will use the icon here too yes and also here So I will use icon here. Yes, yeah, so we have created this. So now let's create the footer. In the footer, you can write the copyright or your profile. You can create your profile here. So I will just write here. just for the purpose so we have created this so now let's run the server what happened we will see that in the browser yeah the error is that with the problem module not found yeah, let's do that uh, export default yeah this name is uh, just correct it let's run that okay successfully interpreted yeah we have now this so now let's make a little bit change in it in the background color so for the background color we should import the CSS file of uh, react pro sidebar so to import that I will import that here import yeah in the CSS I should use this code react pro sidebar text slash CSS style that's it CSS okay you see that okay the background has also came I will just change this one mm, let's come here and wrap it in edge Blue tag Yeah, we have it so now let's make until the end of the screen so first of all we will do that so to do that let's come here and just add a style here style will be like height height handle to vertical height see that okay it has corrected okay now let's it is too much wider so let's make thinner so to do that we will use um, the variable which uh, the react for sidebar provide us to customize our sidebar yeah this package provide us uh, the sas variables to customize our sidebar so let's see which variables we can customize yeah, these are the variables that we can customize like change the bg color the color the weight the collapsed and these are all the variables that we can change them okay we can customize them so now we will just use the width one to decrease the width of the side menu bar we should write it above the input statement so now I will make it example 180 come here see it okay now let's make it to the right side okay we should move it to the right side to do that let's add here just style it direction is equal to our direction rtl okay see that okay see it 
it has become to the right side so let's add here rtl is equal to true see it okay it has changed to the right to the left so i should try that it has a pastor in arabic so it was the sidebar so now let's add some other uh, properties of this react pro sidebar yeah to change other properties of the react pro sidebar you will come to the documentation of this in nfmjs website so whenever you come here you will see that uh, you can change these are the variables that you can change okay you can override them and also these are the properties that you can change for example for pro sidebar collapsed you can collapse it you can toggle and toggle breakpoint you can use the breakpoint for the pro sidebar and also you can change the width of that and also collapse width whenever it collapsed how much the width of it should be by default it is 80 pixel by default the width of the sidebar is 270 pixel okay uh, and also you can these are the properties of image uh, and the string just this one okay the menu these are the properties of menu for menu you can use them and for menu item you can use these properties okay and also for sub menu you can use these properties so for other properties just come to the documentation of react pro sidebar you will add to your sidebar so it was all about uh, react pro sidebar from right to left side for all those languages like arabic pasto urdu persian and other languages so if you have liked the video please subscribe our youtube channel thanks for watching